we are here on twitch now i think is it working i appreciate you guys everybody who's here tonight everybody who's watching this back on youtube thank you guys so much for hanging out with me it is time for the new eminem album let's go <laughs> oh my god oh my god Oh, okay, okay. I thought that was a diss. I thought that was a diss, but I'm gonna spit how I wanna spit. Wanna spit the card. That was a why I I I'm not gonna pause that much, okay? But that 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 deserves a fucking replay. Bruce generous. My boy's middle name is Bruce. <laughs> yeah. Fire. Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> Woo. Bruh. This motherfucker set this album off. I'm just playing little people. All right, here. I remember people talking about how they used to listen to Eminem albums and just laugh the whole fucking time. <laughs> All right, here, drink this. No, uh, people suck. Oh. Dumb fucks. Oh, what? <laughs> Jesus, what the fuck? I don't realize that we fucking need each other. I'm drunk because this feels like a banger, yeah. It's not like meant to be a banger, but it, it, it's like a, it's like a, it, it feels like a banger right now. Like this is a perfect drunk on the dance floor, unk, drunk, drunk on the dance floor, banger. Uh, the fact that we got Christopher Reeves mentioned in two tracks already, and we're only four tracks in, this is a classic already. I'm <laughs> Hey. Dude. Hey. 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 Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. This is this is told me not to shit off and quit and get off her dick. Yeah, poor Caitlin. Bruh. I made you. You were nothing till you found me. I always come back. The coup de grace is the final shot. Before I get banned, kicked off Twitter, and it might have a steady be and cool C. Bet it's my ex Molly that I've led to death already set Ooh. the head. Has Eminem ever referred to ecstasy as Molly ever? And then also just like talked about his addiction to ecstasy, which is very low key. Oh my god. <laughs> Who? What? Candace. Oh, Candace. She's already making a fucking response YouTube video. 100%. <laughs> Bruh. Uh, Chastity, I just want to re read your chat real quick. I think every song goes back and forth from Slim to Marshall, like Slim sings one and then our Marshall sings the next song. Is that what's happening right now? Chastity, if you just fucking caught that, I'm going a, I'm to a fucking gift you a sub right now. Yeah, this is like from Slim Shady, huh? You're fucking right, Chastity. I think you're right. 
I have I'm like speechless dude Bizarre He was in the back Yes Let's go baby I wanna fuck that <laughs> oh, he's a, he's gonna be a guest now for sure. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Did JID just renegade my boy right, Doc, Doc, like right in the in the in the middle of the album? Okay, okay, okay. I hope my boy shows up. I just I gotta pop another um Zen sponsored by Zen. Please do not laugh at the way I put my Zins in. My wife always says I look weird and stupid and talk shit. It's silly, but don't laugh. There you go, bro. That's my goat. <laughs> yeah, dog. J JID was so went so hard in the beginning of there. I was got a little like scared for a second. Now we're about halfway through the album. So what I gotta do is I gotta take a piss break. This so far, I just wanna say real quick. I think this is already an instant classic. I used to say that a lot, but I stopped saying it a lot, but I'm gonna say it right now. This is an instant classic. Is he just, is this just a straight up diss track to fat people or what? Sorry, Tip Bone, I think he's dissing you right now, but you're not as fat as you used to be. We call him Titty Boy. It feels like a diss, like a like a like a romantic diss to fat people. <laughs> Either do something about it or own it. This is exactly what I said. This is a romantic diss song to fat people, and I'm here for it. <laughs> Back again. But yeah, this is a great track. I love the music video. I actually did an entire reaction video to this. Go check that out. But we're going to skip this and we're going to listen to the next one. Oh my God, we're about to get a guilty conscience too. Let's fucking go. Oh my right. God! Beautiful, eh? Alright, you got what you wanted. Yeah. What? The back when they laughing from me to tennis. The stop beating down the special me child. Me people freak out. Exact same song. Just immature and literally. Wow. Middle. I'm careful, legions. Man, seriously. Oh, Damn. It's a joke. No, it's the same they had it, but up to here with me. <laughs> oh, hilarious. You. I think they've had it. Up to here with me too. Perfect as you fuck midgets. I mean, child rule. There you go. I fuck with it. It was a cool flow. But like, he should have put me on that track. I think I could have done a better head honcho. Is that crazy? Is that crazy to say? I was just bored. I was just looking for lyrics and shit. I mean, now that Eminem's playing, I mean, I'm gonna listen now. But I mean... Damn. Fire. 
Hey, I didn't like that track at first, but I'm going to like it now. That's the first track I didn't actually like on Spotify. I'll like it now just because Eminem's verse. I didn't, I'm not saying I didn't like Easy Mill's verse. That was, that was the only dip so far. Damn. All it takes is a new day sometimes to get paid of mine. That was crazy, bro. That's crazy. Yeah, to help you cope with life now that I'm gone. Being goodbye is just not ever easy. But why you Fuck, dude. Me and move on. You can play me on repeat on a song. Straighten up, little soldier. Then times when I held you. A part in this painful. And darling, the brain will drop you in. Uh, and I back and forth to the studio. We used to drive. I'm okay. I'm good. I'm okay. Get it, dude. I'm fine. <laughs> I was not expecting that at all. I feel like at this point, Slim Shady's dead, right? And this is just Eminem now. I, I'm like speechless. I'm like. The thing that's even crazier, Chastity, is like I have a daughter who's much younger than Haley, but like I've always like had this obviously this connection with Eminem and the fact that he had Haley and I had Victoria, and I made music and Eminem made music. Like there was always like this weird parallel there. Haley song, all those, all that music, Mockingbird, like you said, like they they meant so much to me to hear that. And, and also intertwining that with the shit I, I've been going through and my fear of death and the thing that stuck with me the most in that is that he said the thing that that scares me the most is not being able to say the, those things that I want to say, you know, and that is like when I really get deep and thought about death, like that's what scares me the most is like. I feel like in that moment, you, you, what you're going to fear is like, oh, I still want to say this. I still want to do this. I still want to say that. You're... <laughs> I like that. Hold on. I, I wasn't paying attention there. I'm still kind of zoned out. Let me, let me. Wow. Jelly roll next for sure now. How about with that one? So Toby. Next track we already heard. I feel like we got a couple filler tracks here towards the end of the album. Which is okay. I will say that I'm okay with head honcho and, and Toby being there so far because temporary absolutely just jaw dropping amazing stand lose yourself level track yeah we're gonna skip toby but we might need the help. wow wow <laughs> Was he fucked up right there, bro? And it is Jelly Roll. He was fucked up in the beginning there. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna start it over. I'm sorry. I'm talking too much. I don't want to talk throughout it, but it, that just fucked me up because that's him super fucked up. God damn it, yo. Okay. Oh my god, bro. I, don't know. I can't even listen to a song after that. That's so bad. That's tough. That's tough. That's tough. That's tough to put in the beginning of a song, yo. I have videos and like clips and things, a couple things like that. Ugh. 
I'm sorry to pause it. I just need. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> the way Eminem has classically kind of like formatted his track lists, the end of this album was low key like Guilty Conscience 2. And then there was this new like EP that came out from Head Honcho until Save Somebody Save Me. I'm like legit speechless at this point. Legit. Um, I don't even want to say too much right now because I feel like I need to sit with this album for a while and just take it all in. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> I legit, I don't know what to say. I can't wait to listen again. Exactly, exactly, Adam. I can't wait to listen again. So many emotions at this point. Yeah, for real. It started off in such a wild way and ended in such a different way. And I think that's exactly what he wanted. And emotionally, I mean, like, like I can't remember really listening to an Eminem album and, and feeling like this in a long time, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I don't know how to explain it or any album in general. This is such a cool night too. It's such a cool way of doing it. There's been certain moments where like I saw an incredible set at like Coachella or something like that. And I just, I, it's really hard for me to talk afterwards because it was just so intense. That's really how this felt tonight. I wasn't expecting to get emotional and shit like that and everything else. Please subscribe on YouTube. Peace out. Follow me on Instagram if you guys want to like stay up to date. I post on my stories all the time. My stories are fire. Audible underscore 484.